Hey guys, so here is the rainbow trout. Obviously, make sure that it is defrosted and filleted. We don't go to a fresh fish market, so we get ours. So after you do that, then you crush up all of your pretzels into about this size, that kind of thing. Obviously, not too big and not too small of a crumb, I guess you could call it. Then over here, you're gonna have a little bit of oil in your pan, not a whole bunch. Obviously, you can see there's enough to like coat it and be a little bit extra because you're going to be pan frying it. So, we are about to heat everything up and start seasoning up the food. Okay, guys, the so first thing he's going to do is make the honey mustard. So, as you can imagine, it consists of mustard and. Oh, okay, well, he's getting all fancy. Pepper. Don't you hear our lovely children in the background? Salt. <laughs> Little baby fingers. And honey. Or if you wanted to cheat and take a shortcut, honey mustard dressing. And of course you can add whatever like flavors and stuff you want to it. So you mix it up to taste however you like it. Um, that's what we're doing now. You can get it to the consistency and obviously make sure there's enough for all of your fish. We have three fillets that we're working on. And ta-da! Homemade honey mustard. So you brush around on the fish, make sure that it's well coated so the pretzels will adhere to it. Obviously, little man down here is really hungry or just wanting to do it with them. Like everything else he wants to do in life. Look how pretty. Stop. Once your fish is coated, it'll look like this. And then I guess the next step, we're gonna put it in the pretzels, babe. Yep. So all these little pretzels and stuff that you ground and basically made crumbs out of. <laughs> You'll take your fish, lay it in there. And uh, while you're doing all of this, you can do the stove, that way your oil will be ready. So put your fish in the pan by the time that put you it to are. Like medium done. high. Yes. So put on medium high heat. We have ours. Ours is like one to well low to high. So about medium high heat. So ours is on a six, which obviously is a little bit more than the halfway heat. And then we'll show you how to put it in the pan and sear it. Okay. So now we're gonna coat the fish in the pretzels. And it looks like that. Then you put that in your oil, pretzel side down. And do a sizzle. So on this so on this side, you do it for about three to five minutes and you flip it over on the skin side and also cook it for three to five minutes. This fish looks like after you flip it. Um it wasn't exactly three minutes. That's generally just how long we um have it cooking for. But as you can see, the pretzels are brown, the flesh is um, looking all flaky and stuff. So flip it on the other side, the skin side, that way your skin can get crispy. And if you are a little fearful that it's underdone, like for any reason, you can cook it a little bit longer on the skin side as opposed to the pretzel side. So repeating the stuff that we've already shown you, an optional thing that you can do is to take the rest of your honey mustard sauce and drizzle it on top. Um, that's completely optional. Some people like it, some people don't. Some people like to keep it crispy. Others would like the extra flavor. So this is the finished product. These two over here have the extra honey mustard on it. This one does not. We left it as such so that way y'all could see the difference, like the textures and all of that kind of stuff. So it's really just personal preference at this point, whether you want it like this, maybe a little extra crunchy or here and like the extra boost of the honey mustard flavor but yeah so that is how we make the rainbow well the pretzel crusted rainbow trout with the honey mustard sauce